that's where our stalled stationary front is going to set up through the night and tomorrow and that boundary is the dividing line between the drier air that's seeping into some of our westernmost areas and the moisture that remains for the rest of us and that will make a difference in terms of rain coverage. As mentioned, the eastern areas may have some persistence of the rain pattern through the late night hours, but I do think tri-state areas, drier through tomorrow, moisture still lingering along the coast and the eastern half. I think Highway 319 is a good dividing line between the dampness that will persist east of that highway and the relative dryness west of there. Into Saturday, that moisture does tend to make a comeback, and we can see those uh, rain chances increasing once again. Forecast lows tonight will be primarily right around 70 degrees, maybe some upper 60s in the eastern or westernmost areas, and our rain chances will stay around half the region, maybe even increasing a bit on Sunday. A second batch of dryness may come in towards Tuesday and Wednesday, and that can maybe reduce the rain chances for all of us.